Hi, I'm Tim Chapman, and uh, I am a professional landscape and fine art travel photographer. This will actually be my 41st year photographing. I'm a predominantly a six by seven film photographer. I travel the world and photograph places that uh, are seldom seen. And uh, over the last number of years, it's been a lot of places that are under threat. So I've been up to uh, Greenland, into uh, Vietnam, Cambodia, Siberia, and China as well. So I come back with images that uh, are quite different than what people are used to see. And my most popular images are from Chernobyl. I do portraits in the landscape. So basically I get away from the, the clutter of the big scene. And I try to find the intimate little details that give the uh, nature its personality. A problem with some types of wall art is that after six months or so, it kind of can become furniture where you don't notice it all that much. I don't want my pieces to be like that. So I go out of my way to make sure I'm capturing images that are really, really unique and different, but have an effect on the viewer. When you look at my Chernobyl stuff, the images are quite simple because I'm taking portraits of what was happening in Chernobyl. So whether it be a, uh, an abandoned chair, a piano tipped up on its side, bumper cars that have never been ridden, those are type of images that instead of feeding the soul, they feed the brain. So they, they really force you to interact with them because they're so different of anything that you've seen before. I take almost an engineering approach. I've got an idea in my head of the type of image that I want to capture. When I show up at the location and I've done all my due diligence and I'm well prepared, finding the images will come easier that way because they're already up here. And being a film photographer, there's great value in the currency of each image. They deserve care. So I don't spray and pray. I don't take a lot of photographs, but I know that when I'm about to capture one, everything is right. I photograph stuff that stimulates me. It's not necessarily going to stimulate, all my images are going to stimulate everyone the same way. We're all going to have different interactions with them. So I would rather not have my work in every home, have it in the right homes. And um, because there's been enough people that have supported my work and bought my work over the years uh, that get that, that enables me to always maintain and keep my passion about what I do for a living. And I've been so fortunate that way.